That's right. <laughs> a look at the winner premiere of Station 19 with Fire Zaddy himself, Boris yep. Kojo. He's joining us now. Welcome, Boris. Boris, look at this get up. Hey, this guys. Hey, so guys. Good. Well, this is this had to uh, meet the approval of my daughter when I left the house. Oh, hey. good call. Which is a very tough thing to do because usually when I step out, she goes, no. <laughs> really? Nope. Change. Go. Sounds right about right. How old are the kids now, by the way? Sophie's going to be 18 next month. Uh -oh. <gasps> and Nico oh. just turned 16. Oh. But he's 6'6. Six, six. Yeah, oh yeah. He's and playing ball, right? Yes. He's a hooper and Sophie's on her way to college in the fall. Like it's How are insanity. you guys are you and Nicole ready for that? It's no. a big adjustment. Yeah. No, not ready for it at all. Well, in a, in a way we are cuz we're looking forward to the whole empty nester thing, but I think we're romanticizing it a lot. Yeah. And I think the truth will set in when they leave and we we'll oh, be like yeah. Yeah. With two yeah. gone, the house is just too quiet. Yeah. You miss yeah. the cast. Yeah. But then they come home and they stay out really late. And you're like, yeah, maybe you go back to college. The whole little staying out late thing, the whole dating thing is a whole other thing that yeah. I'm not really. <laughs> a whole other level of stress. I huh? have rules. You know, I'm German, so I got rules. I said I said to Sophie, I said, look, or Nicholas, I said, if you want to go on a date outside, you can do the, whatever you're doing outside. You can do it right here in the yeah. house. Well, come on in. <laughs> you want to go watch a movie? We got we right got here. all kinds of streamers <laughs> and movie right. channels. Mom and I are ready. We got you want to have food somewhere? Come here. <laughs> Especially if you have a boyfriend who have him cook for you <laughs> right here in the kitchen. I like that move. And if you can't cook, I make have him make a sandwich. Dad's right here. We got right postmates. Here. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Very cool. Yeah. Uh, for those who may not be familiar with the show, uh, Boris, break it down for us a little bit. Well, Station 19 is a group of firefighters um, who are saving lives during the day and deal with their own personal issues at night. That's uh. the best way of putting it. And I'm so excited about the winter premiere. I like a crossover. Yes. What kind of crossover are we doing? Every time we have a crossover with Grey's Anatomy is exciting, just it because really you're is. one big happy family. And uh, I'm 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 the luckiest guy in the world working with people I love and respect, and then being able to pay respect to the real life superheroes that we represent on TV, and firefighters that are on the front line saving Absolutely. our lives every single day. Wait, can you give a little more on the, of the crossover? No, it's top secret. Well, the crossover, it, okay, uh, I don't know how much Maybe I can say. Maybe we could. Maybe Somebody, we can. Somebody's house is on fire. That you oh. know very well. That you know very, very well. Ah. And I can't say her name or his name, but her name rhymes with <laughs> spiritive play. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Yeah. That's a good team. I didn't give anything away. Not did one not, thing. Did nope. not. Good thing you guys are firemen, though. That's, <laughs> That's going to work right. out well. Oh I yeah, we'll, we'll hope so. We'll hope so. Yeah. Um, congratulations, by the way, on Real, Hus uh, Real Husbands of Hollywood, man. I can't believe it's been uh, ten years. Ten years. Yes. How's that, that possible? Like that, huh? It's insane. Yeah. Ten years ago. Now, wow. Wow. When that, that, that first came about, that had. group. Yeah. Break it down for us, though. Who in the group? was the wildest, who had you laughing the hardest? Well, obviously, Nick Cannon was the wildest. Dude's got 12 kids, <laughs> right? <laughs> Wait, I think it's gone more. We all got together, and we <laughs> grabbed him, and we put him under the knife <laughs> just to protect him from himself. Right? Yeah. He, he, he's got a lot of kids, and that's that's a lot of... I know what the responsibility looks like with two kids. So to, to have... It's a lot of kids. It's a lot of yes. kids. Yes. What do you remember about that time in your life? <laughs> it's just the it's a brotherhood. We're real brothers and to be on camera playing these hyper real versions of ourselves and just being able to do whatever we want and be crazy and rag on each other. Yeah. Play tricks on each other, pranks. I mean, you know, Kevin and, and Nick, they're like pranksters galore. What they do is insane. I love That's it. Fun, but it's man. always fun. We always get together still and love each other, and those are amazing, amazing people. I bet that's a good time right there. We want to get your uh, opinion on some hot takes, okay? okay. From your crew. That's okay. right, from the Real Husbands crew. So All we're right. going to start with uh, Philly native, diehard Eagles fan Kevin yep. Hart. Spent yep. sixteen and a half million dollars on a real eagle. BS. That's, true. No. That's, what, that's what the word is. How he you think didn't he... spend sixteen million on the eagle. Sixteen and a half. That, that, no. sound, that sounded a little inflated to me. Yes. What's the real story? What's <laughs> like, the real story? Like uh, sixteen hundred, maybe. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Come on, get out of here with They're that. They're not that no extinct. Way. We're if sixteen he, half million. No, exactly. And if he <laughs> if he spend that much money on anything, we would go to his house right now. Right. And get right. that bird. Beat Intervention. His butt. <laughs> oh no. Hell no. Uh, yeah. Nelly and his ex Ashanti went viral after they reunited of the holidays for a steamy performance performance of their song, Body On Me, oh. if they're both single, do you think they should uh, give the relationship another go? I mean, you know, they're, they're both grown-ups. They know what they need to do. And, yeah. uh, you know, if love is there, fight for it. Fight for it. Come on, Mo. Boris knows how Let's to fight how for it. it plays Romantic. Out. Is, is your boy Nick Cannon <laughs> done having babies, or will he have another one? Like I said, he, he won't. No. It's medically impossible, because we... 
we took grabbed them and we we handled it. We handled it. Okay, <laughs> good, good. Uh, <laughs> you in your real life are the most romantic of all the men from the show. How yeah. was Valentine's Day with Nicole? Well, I had about eight hours, and she's shooting in New York City on on you know, uh, um, and just like that. So I, I flew to New York, and I surprised her. Oh, that's so. She funny. didn't know I was coming. So I got it. I went to a house in New York, and I called her from the living room. She was in the bedroom sleeping. It was like six in the morning, and I said, "Hey, babe, I miss you. Happy Valentine's." And we were on the phone for like three minutes, and I walked with the phone into the room, and she lost, lost it. it. She's like, ah! Yeah. Was she dressed as Lisa Todd Wexley, her character, and it just like that? Is Kid, she was in bed. Oh. <laughs> Not at six, six in, the in the morning. Not at six in the morning. I thought she was method. I like that, <laughs> I like that you guys um, also uh, uh, work together and keep it in the family, too, because I know you've got a, a collab with Jim Rat. Yes. And you're going to be over at QVC, right? Tell us Very about that. Very exciting. Well, the funny thing about QVC is that I, that's how I learned to speak English. Really? I would put QVC on, and I would mimic what they were saying. That's how I learned English. So it's kind of a full circle moment for us. Uh, and Nicole especially, because uh, the gym wrap now is turning into a full line of yoga wear, uh, exclusively done and produced for QVC. And we're going to be on QVC in a couple of days. There Wait, it is. February 24th, awesome. Friday. Don't miss it. You're going to be, we're gonna be on there. The yes. Good Live you, on QVC. Boris and Nicole. There it is. Friday the 24th. Don't miss it. <laughs> That's <laughs> super cool. All right, something for Nicole before you go, because you're a fire zaddy. Yeah. We made you. Uh, a what? very special calendar. Uh, what? Your own Fire Zaddy calendar. Oh Let's scroll through days. some months, shall we? Hello. Oh Start with God. January. Hey. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, those are short, player. Oh. Where's the month of February? <laughs> Just chilling. Okay. Oh, Look, March. You know what? You know what? I'm about to turn 50, so that's okay. <laughs> there, you and I both. That's there we right, go. That's right. Come on. That's right. See, fifth level. There you go. Fifth All level, right, you gotta lose see? it. Putting uh -huh. out that fire right uh -huh. there. Right oh, wow. Station okay, 19 okay. returns with an all-new episode Thursday night on ABC. <laughs> and, of course, streams on Hulu. Coming up. This is amazing. You don't want to miss our <laughs> very that. first this pet pageant. It's really for you. Oh it's going to be fascinating. It's coming up next. <laughs> uh, give that to the wow.